Hey everyone, welcome to my channel, it's me Crimson. This is going to be something new for me on this channel. Usually it's great gaming content. Well, we've got a game series coming out called Fallout. And uh, I'm a major fan of the series, of the game series. So I'm hoping that this is going to be just as good. I'm hoping it's going to stay, you know, as close to the games as they can. And to the low of the, the world of Fallout. I've got my bobblehead ready, my vault boy bobblehead. And I've got my Brotherhood of Steel armor little things ready and i'm ready to um yeah i'm ready to react to this i've never done reaction videos before i'll probably get flagged by youtube for some odd reason i'm gonna try and abide by the rules that they have set so a lot i've, I've masked the screen so you can't you can't if you if you're here to watch it then don't go to amazon prime watch it when it's meant to be watched and once you've watched it come back and watch my video Come and watch me react to it. Come and see what my thoughts on certain parts of the of the series were. And uh, tell me in the comments below what you think of it so far. What's your favourite part about Fallout? And your favourite Fallout memory. And let's get into it. Oh, I'm so excited for this. The end. Uh, it's only just started, but I'm, I'm liking the way they've set everything up. Oh, it's just like Fallout 4. It's just like Fallout 4 with a bit of the video when, um, a uh, bit of the game when, uh, you've got the radio and stuff in the background as you're making your character and getting used to the world and the buttons and whatnot. It's a nice birthday cake. Oh, it's the, um, this thing, I'm sorry I'm going to be pausing a lot because you're supposed to pause it when you're reacting. But, Mr. Handy, we've got our first little glimpse into Mr. Handy. It's the party, let's just focus on the party, okay? <laughs> yeah, I suppose, why not? Must be his daughter. All right, birthday boy. Let's get a photo of you up here on Sugarfoot. Why the hell is Cooper Howard working kids' birthday parties? What else? Alimony. money. <laughs> What'd they say, Dad? You know, I'm lucky to have such a good helper like you. Yeah, that's exactly what they said. All right, you ready? Coop, coop, do your thumbs up. Yeah, you know, given the state of everything, I prefer not to if that's all right. Why not? That's what you're famous for. Ah, uh, the thumbs up, like the, the vault boy next to me by you. Uh, supposedly, they used to say that you put your thumb... Ooh in front of um, a nuclear explosion, and if it's bigger than your thumb, you're screwed. <laughs> and um, if it's, like, smaller than your thumb, you have a chance. Which is a complete lie, because nuclear war is end all of everything. Yeah. We gotta, we gotta get this rodeo on the road. I can't thank you enough, Mr. Howard. Pleasure is all mine, ma'am. I hope your son had a lovely birthday. Perfect. Yeah. <laughs> well, Who's ready for might be his last birthday. You ready, Janie? Come on. There you go. Pinko. Yeah. I still took my money. Happy birthday! Hey, money's money. But do what you can do. I like the old the old fashioned stuff, but also with futuristic the futuristic aspects and fallout. That's pretty cool. Is that Los Angeles sunshine coming through? See they, they still got black and white TV. They got all that technology, but still black and white TV. I don't even know if there's going to be a next week. happy thoughts not, today. Can Nuka-Cola? Sugar bombs! Grog Death and Grog Barbarian. That's the, um, used to be the magazines and the games you could collect to have, like, uh, stuff right. connected to your stats. I think that's everything. Usually melee builds would use it. <laughs> really big bomb. I told us to hold up your thumb just like this. That's what I said. The cloud is smaller than your thumb. Now you run for the hills. And if it's bigger than your thumb? You're screwed, honey. They told us not to bother running. Do you think it's gonna happen? I certainly hope not. But us cow posts. That's what any parent would we'll probably say to their kids. <laughs> Can I have a slice, Dad? You know, let me see. If I can't muscle you up, please. 
Go on, have a piece of cake for the end of the world. This is not so bad then. Oh shit. Oh, the fam. The fam. All right, one piece of cake. Uh, oh god. Cowgirl. Is it your thumb or mine? Oh lord. Are oh, they doing the slow mo? Now, in reality, we all know that that would happen in so fast. This slow mo is still su is way too slow. <laughs> like it would just go, pew, pew, pew. it'd be done. It wouldn't be going this slow in real life. But cinematic effect, I like it. Makes sense. Like, it happened a lot faster than that. I'm no expert, but I think... Oh, shockwave. Pick her up. Get out of there. Just don't... Run! Get on your horse and freaking go! Oh, God, that's coming quick. Oh, they got a fallout shelter. Not the uh, the vaults, but I bet people have plenty of those shelters. They probably wouldn't do much. All the buildings are falling. Go, 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 go! I don't think that horse is going to get you very far, but, you know, it's worth a try. Yep, they're happening everywhere. Oh god, that's three. They're awfully close. You're screwed. That one is like literally there. Oh. Fallout. Fallout. 219 years later. My name is Lucy McLean. And I'm an active contributor to the well-being of my... Oh, we got our vault person. Repair skills. I enjoy participating in the Young Pipers Association, which... Oh, she's pregnant. Active. <laughs> Science skills. Obviously, mine are nothing compared to my dad's, but I always relish a challenge. Speech skills. My primary passion is teaching American history with a focus on... Well, yeah, the, we're still going to teach the kids. I in gymnastics club. Fencing Team C. Fencing so she can fight? Well, Intermediate phys ed. Yep, like UFC fighting. And I dabble. That'll be good for when uh, eventually she gets out of this vault. I'm not very good. How she does that, we'll find out. In my personal time, I enjoy taking walks and watching movies with my dad. <laughs> yeah, can't exactly just walk. Gardening, also with You've them. got to walk up the spot. And participating in my family book club. We're still trying Ooh, to get my They got video board. games. He'll come around when he's ready. My reproductive organs are intact, my hygiene well maintained, and yet oh Lord. I have been unable to find a suitable marriage partner. At least one I'm not related to. And we have Good point, like because eventually people would repopulate and then eventually so, there'd be everyone to be related. Sound mind and, body that I hereby submit my application to the council and they'd probably to participate be in the triennial trade people born with too. weird things because of the radiation in this world. Oh, she's been approved. So it must be like interlocked vaults or something. If they can move vaults, like quite exactly, unless they go, they got a system where they go to the surface, make it to the other vault, and stay. The thing is, with the vaults, a lot of them were actual scientific experiments. Like if we, if you played the game, you know this. But if you haven't, basically the vaults, um. They said they were for safety, but they weren't for safety. They were for, like, experiments on humans and, you know, different things. Like, there was one vault, I, I remember reading the law, where they had a vault full of men and one woman, and they had a vault full of women and one men, and it was like, how it all went crazy. <laughs> and there's that other vaults. There's plenty of law there. I, I love... 
I could tell you this now. I I love the sets already. It feels like what a Fallout vault would actually look like. The moment I met your mother. Hmm. Oh, sad backstory. Dead mother. From that moment on, Vault 31 was a distant memory to me. <laughs> Overseer? It's time. Oh, he's the Overseer. Oh. Probably best if we reschedule with the 32s until maintenance and I can... Jet. He doesn't want What's it to What's going go. on? Lucy, I love you. Oh. We all know that, Jet. Messing around with your cousin, it's all well and good for kids, but it's not a sustainable long-term sexual practice. Are they cousins? Oh. Yeah, I know. Here we go. Press the big red button. Oh, the... The sound. Oh, the sound. The sound! The... Audio director, whatever it's called. Well done. Oh, wow. Welcome, neighbors from Vault 32. I am Hank McLean, overseer of Vault 33. They're looking more... Lee Moldaver, Overseer of 32. Thank is, you. Is it me or do they look dirtier than the other ones? We're sorry to hear of Overseer Jackson's passing. Like their costumes and stuff. When blight hit our wheat, we lost a lot of good people. But this trade will help us get back on our feet. Yes. As arranged, we this offer trade. you seed and parts for machinery. In exchange, we offer you a breeder. So... <laughs> Who am I marrying? <laughs> <laughs> oh, what should be some... Are you gay a choice? Oh no? I'm Lucy. Do you have a name? Monty. Hmm. I'm unsure already. Lucky. Mm -hmm. Lucky. Well, he looks alright, but... Looks and actual the way he is is different. Maybe. Yeah, this is what I was saying earlier. They're, so they're both very now? different vaults. One one must have a lot of problems, and uh -huh. this other one is being run. Your vault good. doctor must check every physical. No. What they got? Ta it is what I'm saying. I'm telling you, the one vault was full of good and upstanding people and the other vault was full of delinquents and drug dealers and stuff. It's one of those situations where the one vault was full of bad people and the other vault is full of good people and they're seeing how they interact. I'm telling you, that's what's happening. We are bonded. I know it's 219 years in the future, but it gets passed through generations. But by a shared duty. Something's going on. Have they already opened their vault? Have they, have they already opened their vault and these people, they're like bandits. They're not actually part of the vault. This is why people never watch oh, series with me because I can try, I kind of work out stuff before it's there. Right before it's shown. Picture the Christmas mornings around the tree. We have everything with the hand-me-downs, an icebox, a blender, they, they even gave us... <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> there's a butt on my screen! And there's something else in front of her screen. I might have to skip this part of the video. Because he's entering her vault right now. <laughs> right, see you in a minute, skip! Yeah, I definitely had to skip that last segment of the... <laughs> yeah, that's not safe for YouTube, what I just witnessed. Oh wow, he's gone into their vault. Wow, their crops are dead. Yeah, I think I'm correct. I think the one vault was given crops that would work, 
and the other vault had been given crops that were surely meant to just not last. And then the science experiment is to see how the two vaults would interact with each other. Ah! Oh. Nice. I'm not going to explain what I just witnessed. He's going to get caught or something now. This is not good. He's... This, this vault is absolutely decimated. Oh, oh crap, it's a dead body. And he's missing a leg. They're eating each other. They've been eating each other. What the hell? Oh, shit. I'm right! They're, they're from the surface! They're from the surface! The radiation levels on him are crazy! Oh, shit. Raiders. 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 <laughs> oh, crap. It's him over the edge or something! Smash him! Kill him! Oh! Oh, Jesus. This was the best day of my life. Well, this is your last. Oh, cock punch! He's <gasps> been stabbed. Come on, somebody come save her. The father, the brother, someone. She doesn't need it, she saved herself. Oh! Well, he got what he deserved, but oh! Don't pull it out. Don't pull it, you never, you never pull out the knife wound. Guys, if you ever get something stuck in your body, never pull it out like she just did. I know it's a series, but real life, that's not what you do. A step back! Stab, stab in your armor up for the best. That's, that's what works in the games. <laughs> Don't lose your head. Oh, crap. Oh, this is brutal, man. What you shoot him with? Oh, God. Oh, they wear the Raider armor as well from the games. Oh, Jesus Christ. Is he on, like, Psycho or something? I'm loving this series, all right? This is amazing. This is brilliant. I'm so happy whoever made this. I'll have to find out the direct... Oh, she just got stabbed in the eye with a fork. Go on, pregnant lady! I don't know your name, but go on! Sir, please don't make me use force. You idiot. Oh, he's using jet. Oh! <laughs> he got squashed! Oh, he's coming at everything! Was she, the brother's safe. Oh my god, that guy's still alive! Oh my god, his face! Oh, I'm not gonna show it on the screen. Oh, dad, daddy's home. <laughs> Double tap. Double tap. Double tap, please. He's not dead. Double tap him. Good father. Good man. Oh, why was their father's brutal? Ooh, their father is not... Hmm... I 
I think her father has a bit of a past that we will find out about. Oh, crap. There's a bomb. Oh, Welcome. shit. We're going to find out the truth? So I'm going to offer you a choice. Them or her. What? Oh, it's not much of a choice. Sorry, guys. Let's pick up the daughter. You are my world. Oh, man. How does she know her mother? Where are you taking him? To the real world. You should see it sometime. Oh, so he's not dead. Run and hide. Dive! Dive to the side or something! Yeah, uh, don't stay by the window! I gotta be honest, that sequence of events so far has got me invested in this already. And I am looking forward to this. Um, Brotherhood of Steel thin. Because I used to always like playing for the Brotherhood of Steel, even though I know that, you know, they're technically you know, good guys, but they're not bad guys. But at the same time, they're not really good guys. They're kind of like stuck in their ways. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. He's a bit of a tough guy. Maximus. Oh, that's a very uh, gladiator name. Maximus. Hey, man. How's your nose? Are you not entertained? I can still smell. It's just mostly blood. <laughs> Flesh is weak, but steel endures. I, I know. Go on. Night's fine. Tell me in the comments below what what faction or what did you usually like help out in the games? Like, what was your favorite storylines and stuff? And identify pre-war tech. Yeah, pre-war tech. Access. That's all they're interested in is taking technology back. Oh damn! I didn't realize they were that military, military kind of thing. Oh, it's the warship. The blimp. The war blimp. Oh man, that's cool. Basically a floating death machine. What? <laughs> Let's go. For the exosuits. What kind of model is that? It's the T60. Imagine the T60. One of those every day. Come on, I got something I want to show you. The tree oh. is a two-person job. It's, it's a toilet. <laughs> said, come on. Well, she isn't going anywhere. Somebody got to do it. So they're checking the suits out. Imagine how much of a like monster you must feel in one of them. I was, like nothing can hurt me. Like I'm, I'm super strong. Like you, you'd feel invincible. They're not as invincible as you think. Like a death claw. Can't wait to see one of those. We'd probably rip it apart. Oh, we're getting a flashback. Oh, it's one of those big machine guns. They're celebrating. 
What's going on? A bunch of us were chosen to get anointed. Hey, what's your title gonna be? Squire. Tonight, Titus. And get this, we're going to the wilds. Hell yeah! Oh. It's all happy and stuff, but I don't know. I don't think it's as good as she's thinking. And he's like, why am I not picked? Still in shit duty, like why? Is there a reason they're treating him the way that like like this? Is it because is like an outsider or something? They said they found him as a kid. Talk about losing your shit. <laughs> Shoot me, that was a terrible joke. What's going on? <gasps> What's happening to her foot? Mutate. Is it mutated? <gasps> they're gonna think it's him. Oh, looks like they're rebuilding. Compost. They're literally just like, they don't even bury their dead, they just chuck him in compost. What the hell? <laughs> Stapler! It's not the best idea, but it's not the worst, I suppose. There's a brighter, brighter and I'll tell you something now, I can already tell the way they've written this story that don't get me wrong. Uh, people are like, eh, it's not it's not a male protagonist. Me, 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 me. I don't care. The way they're writing this so far, they're not making it like power, power this, power this, men suck, men are this. They're making a woman, and she's a woman, and they're making her a strong woman. She's you know, she's gonna start off not knowing anything about the world because they don't, and they're gonna make her into a strong protagonist that we will like. It's nothing worse than they just like throwing stuff down your throats, you know. I like the way they're doing this. It's it's good. It feels natural. It doesn't feel forced. I'm gonna get cancelled for that, but I have a proposal I'm, I'm being honest. Assembly. Are they gonna go together, or are they just gonna leave her go? I can't wait to see the scene, you know, where she goes up into the ele in the elevator or whatnot, the shaft you open up, it's just like bright white, and she's just like, Argh. and all of a sudden you just see what's become of the world. It's always my, that was always the best part of Fallout games, we've just, you exit the vault and you're like, wow, where do I go? Because I can go wherever I want. <laughs> I'm not letting anyone else get hurt on my behalf. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Fair enough. Come on, go, 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 go. I'm too chicken. I'm too chicken. Yes. Goodbye, bro. What's gonna happen when she comes back? Is it like, is it gonna be like just normal, or they? I wonder if they're gonna like everything will just go to pot. Everybody starts to know each other, and it's like nobody left. I'm bringing him home. If there's a home left to come back to. Here we go. Out into the world of Fallout. Fallout 33. Stop! Mercy! Are you mad? Young 
Lady, come back here right away. <laughs> uh, no. Nah. They're not going to show me anything. It's going to be next episode. Please show me what the world looks like. I want to see if they've, how they've done it. To the wasteland. Well, no turning back now. I hope she had supplies and stuff. I hope she took water and stuff with her. I hope she just, just, just didn't go out there with weapons. She's got like a bed roll and stuff, so she probably has got stuff in that backpack. Can't imagine seeing that for the first time. Like, all your life you've never seen or even, like, know what the sea is. You just see this endless ocean. Like, imagine your thoughts. You know, he Are they still blaming him for that when it wasn't even him? We have given you a name. Food. Education. A place in Unless the world. Unless it was him. So, I don't think it was, but... We expect you to give us the truth. Why did you join the Brotherhood? To hurt the people who hurt me? Are they raiders killed his parents today or something? You. Ah, oh, blame the outsider. Easy option. No, I, 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 I wouldn't. Why not? Your friend was promoted. You were not. You have ambitions, don't you? Oh God. I, I didn't, I didn't do it. I did not. I. Oh, I even I'm in my chair. I'm afraid to move. I, I went quiet for a second. I was just like, happened. "Is that wrong?" I, I want to thank you. Just for your guidance and. For giving me a home, I, I had no place in the world. Was it, did he so, do it then? Because he's not he's, he's acting a bit guilty at the moment. If I can help the Brotherhood make it better, Eden or whatever, even if it means giving my own life, I'll do it. So, did he? I'm, I'm confused. Did you do it or not, bro? And I'd be grateful to the Brotherhood for giving my life meaning. Good choice of words. Good boy. Screwed yourself into his brain. Well done. And you will be Knight Titus, new squire. Oh. I heard you got my spot. You know who did it? Also, well, it was him. down to any one of those assholes. <laughs> one with a moustache. They asked if it was you. Yeah, they asked me the same thing. I told him you wouldn't hurt a fly. Did he do it? Oh Jesus, they're gonna burn him. Do you accept? Wow, talk about initiation. Oh man, that's gonna sting! Ooh, wow! Of 
the Enclave has escaped. Enclave. Oh, the Enclave. They're basically and the Brotherhood of Steel, but worse. <laughs> so they say. Oh, that's what they were doing. They were doing photos of targets. Oh, not dog meat. That's gonna. That's gonna be dog meat. Surely. Wait. I don't know why, but in the like the recesses of my mind, why does he look like somebody who's used to, who's a scientist but then turns himself into a super mutant? I saw the back of my mind. You, you, the glasses, the look, the sciency look. Like, will we will we see super mutants? That's the thing. I want. I wonder if we will see super mutants. Oh. I'm loving the way they, they make the, uh, the the way they move around, the sounds, everything. I love it. The way the suit looks is, is perfect. Off he goes. That's what you wanted, man. <laughs> I'm smiling. Don't think you'd be smiling for long, though. <laughs> Especially when shit hits the fan. First type of outpost. Oh my god! It's the cannon! It's the, it's, it's the junk cannon! It's from there's, there's a on Fallout 4, I think, and one of the games, there's a cannon, you fill it, you fill it full of junk and shoot it. You just shut it, you just go go! Nerdgasm! <laughs> Don Pedro has our friend dug up once a year, cuts some pieces off and puts him right back in the ground. Huh? What? How long has this asshole been moldering in the ground? How do we know he's not feral? That is why we brought <laughs> our little friend. He's a ghoul. A feral ghoul can't abide a chicken. <laughs> Isn't that Bubba from Forrest Gump, or was it just am I thinking of someone else? <laughs> it's gonna be Danny, Danny Goggins' character, isn't it? Oh, nice. I, I'd, I'd want to crack all my bones as well if I was st stiff for a couple of years, stuck in a bloody thing. Well, well, well. Well, well, well. Why, well, just an Amish production of the Count of Monte Cristo. Just the weirdest circle jerk I've ever been invited to. <laughs> I like him already. <laughs> Welcome back. I'm Huncho. Now, you don't even know us. No, I do not. Now, shoot him. Would you shut the fuck up? We, uh, we got a proposition for you. A bounty came down. A huge one. Enough to be a last score for me and whoever's with me. Yeah, now somebody made a run from the Enclave. They're after, they're after oh, the science guy as well. I'd give a good goddamn about that. It ain't where they's running from. I figured you'd be interested in is where they's running to. Mm. Dead witch, moldy. In California. That's where you from, ain't it? Ah, so the, all these storylines are gonna connect Isn't somewhere then. I mean. Well, I tell you what, boys. Whenever somebody says they doing one last job, that usually means their heart's not in it. Probably never was. But for me, well, I do this shit for the love of the game. <laughs> you just killed your friend. Nice. What are you shooting at? Like scissors and stuff. Oh, man! Oh! <laughs> there was a head, and then there wasn't a head, and then there was. Ah! Nice, the ghoul. You 
you right, friend, about one thing. This right here was your last job. My paycheck wasn't quite what you expected, but, well, you know what they say. Us cowpokes. We take it as it comes. <laughs> Wait, that's how you introduce a character. <laughs> oh, Tommy's a chicken. I take my chicken with me, that's food. The ghouls eat. Well, what can I say? This is fantastic. I, I, if I could give this a, a, a score, and I wasn't really good thinking about doing scores, but to introduce a series, to get people on board, to to keep people that don't know the games happy, and to keep people who know the games happy, this is they they must have watched The Last of Us and learnt that this is the way to do gaming to TV series to movies. This is like the right way to do it, from what I can tell. Outstanding. And uh, people might disagree with me, but I think this possibly could be up there with The Last of Us, the way it's going. In my personal opinion, it'll might change in the future. Perhaps, you know, they made one big episode for the first one and then the next one's going to be crap, which I hope not. I hope not. But thank you for watching my reaction. Please write down in the comments what you thought. Is there anything I could do to improve it? Is there anything that I could have done differently? Um, is there anything you did like? But remember, guys, thank you very much. I'll see you in the next one. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that like button. And I shall see you in the next one. See you there. I'm so happy the series was good. <laughs>